As a member of Parliament serving Veterans Affairs Standing Committee since my very first swearing in, I have grown a deeper and deeper understanding of what and why we civilians must remember. I've been honoured to listen to many veterans who share their experiences, hoping that what they're able to share is enough for those of us who have not lived what they've lived and grasp what our freedoms have cost. The Honour Our Veterans banners that are along our streets recognizing and remembering veterans is one beautiful way of ensuring Remembrance Day is preserved for future generations who, like you and I, must understand that remembering for us means never forgetting what these Canadians have done. I want to thank our Legion members, many who are veterans and others who are family or friends that give so much. During Remembrance Week, they wholeheartedly share history with students in our schools across Canada. They help veterans navigate Veterans Affairs, seeking the financial support and medical care that they need. They collect artifacts from the past and display them beautifully at their legions and in our museums. They provide emergency care to veterans in their moments of need and organize the annual poppy drive and commemorations all through the year. They also support other initiatives in their communities. They are our guardians of Remembrance Day. We must not forget those who gave their lives for us. Their love of country meant that they were willing to risk fighting for other people's freedoms. Many made the ultimate sacrifice. Freedoms are never free, they cost. Freedom to speak and debate in the public square, believe and share one's faith, freedom to choose. These are blessings they died for on our behalf, and that's why we must remember them, lest we forget.